Hi, good evening everyone. It's uh, like uh, being evening here, so I'm greeting with all with a good evening. So I know it's been uh, like a, it's been a old news. The VMware version 17.0 has all been released like a month ago, and I am uh, making this video a month later. Anyhow, so uh, just to let you know, ki, yeah, it's already been the market, and you can download it from the uh, VMware site. So it's approx uh, 607 MB is the size. So already I have downloaded, and yes, already I installed it. So let's explore it. Uh, what is new about this uh, VMware Workstation 17 Pro? You can get uh, like if you have the license key, you can uh, put it here. Either you can just try it for 17 to 30 days. Okay, so right now I don't have the license, so basically I can uh, continue with the trial version. So this is the first interface which I uh, like uh, see from uh, the main screen which I get. So uh, let's see uh, what is the requirement uh, for to install this, what is the basic uh, minimum requirement you need it. So this is the system requirements and uh, you can just check uh, like uh, you can go at this link and you can check all the requirements so whatever you needed to install this okay and here they have uh, listed all the operating system which uh, has been added in this uh, like uh, version 17.0 they have added uh, windows 11 it's already been added in the previous version which was like 16 but in the letter build okay uh, but right now they have listed all the operating system and it's already been there so server 2002 22 is there rhl 9 is there debian and uber 2 all you can see it's already uh, been listed in this uh, version and they have already uh, like added trusted platform tpm 2.0 so you can now uh, install uh, windows 11 right so uh, what will we do like we can install windows 11 with the tpm let's see and uh, and start with installation so here i will just go and uh, i'll create one machine So from this uh, you can just uh, go and you can choose the express edition uh, like everything will be done within a, a minute so uh, I'll just link my uh, window 11 ISO over here and uh, once I select it uh, it will ask me where you want to install the VM the path so the, all the VMs are going to be installed in this location right now uh, so I'll go with the next I will just uh, will do the simple steps okay So uh, here you can see uh, there are two types of encryption which you can choose. Either you can uh, encrypt your whole uh, VMDK, whole virtual disk drive, or either you can just choose the uh, uh, the required part like NVRAM, VMSS, VMEM, VMM, and VMSN. So you can go with these two options. So I'll just choose the the first one, the VMDK. Okay, uh, and I'll just create the password, and I'll proceed. So whatever you are doing, uh, right? So encryption passwords must have at least 18. So I have given it like a six characters, which is not acceptable. So it is uh, like mm, asking me to proceed with it eight digits and more than that. So I will increase the password length. Okay, okay. I'm very. Uh, I'm in rush actually. That's why it's happening. Alright, so here you can allocate uh, the sizing of the disk, so 64 GB would be sufficient to install uh, like uh, Windows 11 and yes, here I have to choose a store virtual disk as a single file, I don't want uh, to make it as multiple. So this is the thing, you can customize the hardware over here, okay, and uh, it can be added uh, later on the later uh, stage also, so I'll just finish it. It will create the VM disk and the installation will start. So let's see how much time it's going to take. I'm uh, having a uh, M M.2 NVMe 512 GB SSD, so it would should not take uh, much time. Let's see how much time it's going to take. So right now the VMDK has already been like created and uh, it now it's been encrypting. So the error which you get uh, while installing uh, like Windows 11 in the older machines, uh, the requirements are not been fulfilled. So uh, TPM and other things, uh, the error you are not going to 
like I'm going to get it on this machine okay okay the machine has been like created so I'm uh, like closing all the browsers which is uh, running in the background okay so I can press any key button I'll maximize it so just so be with me and see uh, what's what the things are happening uh, if you are very uh, like uh, new to the VMware you can just uh, go through these steps and you can install this by yourself also so uh, I have chosen the basic things I haven't like uh, doing anything like manual just going next and next and next so basically I don't have the uh, the product key with me right now so I'll choose I don't have the product key so at this moment you get the TPM error uh, if you are installing this in uh, like uh, in workstation 16 pro in the older version you you will get the error of TPM over here because uh, the older versions are not having the DPM functionality okay but right now in this uh, 17 pro it's already been in build functionality is there so you don't get the error over here so you can choose basically whatever the window you like you can just skip and forward the part or whichever you don't like I'll just install it and see uh, the how smooth the solution process is going on okay I already have uh, like also set it uh, the timer over there so I'll just start it key uh, will see how much time it's going to take so timer we have set it on uh, 15 minutes but I don't think so it's will uh, it's going to take the 15 minutes uh, uh, within a five minutes I think so it will be more sufficient to install this but anyhow uh, let the timer uh, should be there I'll keep myself mute if you want uh, I don't want to like talk unnecessarily so I'll keep my uh, mouth shut for a moment Yeah, the process is like uh, happening uh, very well. It's already been like 56 uh, percent has already been completed. So uh, what I assume, what I assume, okay, the installation process only will uh, will take uh, three to four minutes, not more than that. Uh, meanwhile, I will just show you my PC specs. Yeah, so uh, this is my PC specs. You can already check. Uh, this is a Dell Latitude 7490 with having uh, at least 16 gigs of RAM. So, all right. So these are the things which I am having. right so in between if I see uh, already the installation has been completed by 94% and you can also see like my task manager if you want to check it out so uh, virtualization is already available so please uh, be very sure that virtualization should be enabled if you want to install uh, VMware any type of like uh, virtualization software if you want to install so this should be must be enabled from your BIOS end okay so you need to check it all right and you can see my consumption CPU uh, like and all memory so it's not using like much okay so already the installation has been completed so it's uh, only take like uh, two two minutes not more than that but once uh, like this installation steps gets completed the further it will uh, take at least uh, two to three minutes more so uh, I will just pause it and uh, skip that parts okay so the basic installation of windows ka wo mera pura complete ho chuka hai so now this is the best 
जो बेस्ट थिंग है ना आप होस्ट के साथ जैसे ही आपकी मशीन अप होती है उसके साथ ये आप विंडोज़ एलेवन को स्टार्ट कर सकते हो लाइक जैसे ही आपका होस्ट ऑन होगा ये आपकी जो वर्चुअल वी है ये भी उसके साथ स्टार्ट हो जाएगी ये फीचर न्यू है तो इसको कैसे करना है वो मैं आपको दिखाता हूँ अगर राइट right नाउ अगर आप अभी माई कंप्यूटर पर जाके यहाँ पर राइट क्लिक करोगे कन्फिगर ऑटो स्टार्ट वी एम्स बट जैसे ही आप इस ऑप्शन पर आते हो ये क्या कह रहा है आपसे कि इस सर्विस को इंस्टॉल करने के लिए जो पर्टिकुलर विंडोज़ है जो पर्टिकुलर आपका इंस्टैंस है उसके अंदर जाके ये सर्विस को पहले आपको इनेबल करना होगा राइट सो ये कैसे इनेबल करना है ये आपको यहाँ मिल जाएगा वी के डॉक्यूमेंट्स पे ठीक है तो जो सबसे पहले स्टार्ट रन सर्विसेज और एम में जाके ये वाली जो सर्विस है ना मैं वी एम वेयर ऑटो स्टार्ट इसको इनेबल करना है ठीक है तो वो चेक कर लेते हैं सो so, मैं यहाँ पे आ जाता हूँ यहाँ आपको टाइप कर लेना है रन कमांड सर्विसेज डॉट एम और यहाँ से आप चेक करो कि कौन सा सर्विस हमें करना है वो है वी एम ऑटो स्टार्ट सर्विस राइट सो फाइंड आउट कर लेते हैं वी वो लास्ट में मिलेगा अपने को वी से है 